An Albuquerque mom is in jail tonight after police say they found her strolling down a busy street with her baby in traffic. But as News 13's Crystal Gutierrez reports, the arrest and the allegations are shocking people who know the mother. It started with panic drivers and ended with an Albuquerque mom behind bars. Ms. Apache, good morning. This is a, a child abuse charge. Today, Renee Apache faced a Metro Court judge. Police say on Thursday she was walking down the southbound lanes of San Mateo near Central, and she wasn't braving the dangerous traffic alone. The allegation basically is that you were intoxicated and you were pushing an infant in a stroller uh, on a busy street. The baby is Apache's nine-month-old daughter. Police say she was filthy wearing nothing but a dirty shirt and dirty diaper. Police say when they questioned Apache about her daughter, her speech was slurred and her eyes were bloodshot. Police say the 28-year-old mother was so drunk she blew a .25, more than three times the presumed level of intoxication. Apache's neighbors couldn't believe it. I've never seen them to be, you know, real dirty or not fed or, not, you know, stuff like that. They've been taken care of well. Vera Tenorio found out what happened when police stopped by Apache's apartment and took her two older kids. They were uh, crying that they didn't want to go home. You know, they, you know, they wanted to stay with their grandmother, but they, they wouldn't allow it. Neighbors say the grandmother also lives there, but according to police, all they found inside were beer cans everywhere. Now, it's not the picture neighbors had painted, but the studious mother. When I see her, she goes to school. My sister told me that she goes to school, and that's about it. Crystal Gutierrez, KRQE News 13. And Apache's three kids are now in state custody. Court records show Apache has a DWI conviction from 2002.